Look at that. An episode of getting guy with Carter Andrews. We uh, we're down there with uh, in Panama with Carter. Now we're in uh, White Sulphur Springs. We're about to float the Smith River with uh, Joe Sowerby with the Fly Fishing Connection. Well, the Smith River is it's right in central Montana. It's the only river in Montana that the general public has to put in for a lottery to get down the river. Um, it's 60 miles between public access points. And it's really a one-of-a-kind opportunity in Montana to get on a river, do a multi-day trip, get away from it all, um, spend a few nights camping on the river, and you pretty much have to do all 60 miles. There's no other option. It is the all-American float trip. That's oh. it. It's the all-American float trip. I've guided it about 30 times. Carter's second trip. So hopefully I can show him a couple things as opposed to him showing me everything down in Panama last, last winter. Oh. We got Juan with us. We got oh, but we <laughs> got we got Juan Cito, his mate, <laughs> who is uh, his he's what he keeps saying in America is he's freaking out. He's never been to America before, and uh, we'll take him down the river and see if we can't get him into some uh, brown trout on dry fly. The Smith starts up here in the White Sulphur Springs Valley. It's a in my opinion, the most beautiful part of Montana. Big open views and, and uh, big cow country and, and just beautiful pasture and ranch land. And the river drops down um, through that valley and then comes to this point here where it starts to drop down into the canyon. But as you get down in a few miles, the little limestone cliff walls start to become more and more dominant in their thousand foot canyon walls. Uh, it's really spectacular. Well, the Smith River is a freestone river. Um, it, it has a variety of insects from the smallest trico all the way up to the great big salmon fly stone fly. Um, it's really, really fun uh, because there are a lot, a lot of hatches constantly throughout the season. Uh, it's primarily a brown trout and rainbow fishery. Um, over the years the percentages have swung back and forth but they're about 50-50% right now, rainbows and browns. The fish that we're really get excited about are the big brown trout because there's a lot of nice brown trout in that 15 to 20 inch range. Juancito just caught a big brown trout. Yeah. And this is so cool. And they're spectacular. They're beautiful yellow bellied green heads. Smith River. Yeah, it's my biggest trout. Oof, boy. That fish is so beautiful. And, uh, and, and they, they really make the trip special for me. Look at that.